Hello everyone, welcome to our channel. So in this topic, I mean in this video, we are going to learn about the topic of production function. In already in the previous video, we have discussed about the production function. Uh, what is the production function? What is the formula for it? What are the inputs and what are the outputs and how they affect each other? So we have learned about the relationship in that. So in this, we are going to learn about the production function. Uh, what are the types in that production function? So first one, which is like long run and second one is that short run so what is the long run and what is the short run so first we are going to long run so long run which describes about the long term period so for the long term how the production will be changing what are the changes in the production function so in the law actually we consider some of the input factors like land labor organization and capital these are some of the input factors which we use in the production. So these are the inputs which will be changing in the long run. So they will be changing in the input factors during the long tip period of the time. Suppose a company will be having a lifetime of 15 years. So in that 15 years how this production will be changing. So in the production sometimes the production may be high and the sometimes the production will be low. So there is changing right in the production. So in that way also if the production is changing means that is labor and capital whatever we are investing also will be changing. If you want the more in when more production we will increase the number of the labors. If we need just uh, average production we will decrease the labor if we no, no need of some of that much work. And capital also as well if we want to produce more and more we have to invest more amount. So in this way all the input factors will be changing in the long run. There will be no difference between the no difference between the fixed and variable there is no fixed and no variable that is all the factors will be continuously changing in the long run so second one is short run what is short run which describes the changes of the functions for the short time means short duration so in the short duration how it's like uh, short duration it may be one year it may be for six months so it's whatever the six months or one year how the production and how this are affecting what is the changes so here in the short run for a given period of time the inputs whatever land labor organs and these are capitals are there some inputs are changed and some inputs are unchanged so in this short run all the uh, inputs are not changed so only some are changed and some are remaining unchanged so what are that unchanged and what are the changed so first we'll uh, discuss about the changed the changed is men so we are considering the factors which are changing is called as men so how these are changing so as we want a more production so in the short term in the when we are starting a company we have to produce more because we have to get a profit right so to produce more production we have we need more money and more uh, men also right so to work more and to produce more so we are increasing the number of money I mean sorry number of men so this is called as a changed or variable so the input factor which is a men is changing this is one of the example for input changed so otherwise what some inputs are unchanged so what are the inputs which are unchanged that is money and machinery in the short period of time the money and machinery are considered as a unchanged those this is all about the production function types which are two types long term long run and short term which describes about the long duration time and the short duration time in the next video we'll go discuss about the all the topics which are remained